Hello everybody, I'm Chris Provost, and right behind me is a bathroom, a restroom. And about a month ago, my wife walked into that bathroom and she walked into the wrong one. She walked into the men's and she was mortified, embarrassed. Why did she do that? I think I figured it out. Let me show you. I'm in beautiful Disney California Adventure and we are going to go on an exploration to find out why my wife got confused and walked into the wrong bathroom. First, let's start this adventure in um, Avengers Campus. Beautiful. That's the Guardians of Galaxy Mission Breakout. Fantastic attraction. One of my very favorites. I never get tired of riding it. Like every time I ride it, I still get a thrill and still get fun. It's amazing. We're walking along here. Now, most people know this, but it's still kind of fun to see. I'm just kind of showing a little trivia here. This is the Tavon Collection. First time on display, Guardians of the Galaxy. But you notice that Rock has sold all the letters off the first time display and put Mission down here. So Guardians of the Galaxy, Mission, and then you wrote Breakout. Okay, I just walked through Avengers Campus. I'm now coming into Radiator Springs. Oh, it's very crowded here. Let's go take a look at the bathrooms in Cars Land. I know. Crazy. Let's do it. All right, here's the restrooms here in Cars Land. I don't want to just like film people walking out of the bathroom, but if you'll notice, if you walk down there, it's the entrance. The men's is on the right and the women's is on the left. Men's on the right, women's on the left, right down there. <laughs> I know, crazy subject, but we have to discover this mystery of why Amanda went into the wrong bathroom. Dun, dun, dun. All right, we'll continue on here. It's the Flo's VA Cafe. We're gonna turn to the right over there. Hi, how are you? All right, here we are at uh, walking through Cars Land. I think it's absolutely gorgeous and beautiful. I love it. I never get tired of looking at it, and it's beautiful to me during the daytime and at nighttime. Nighttime, particularly, I think this is the most well lit land, the most beautiful land at nighttime. All right, we're gonna walk right through this arch and find another clue onto why did Amanda use the wrong bathroom? Dun, dun, dun. All right, I have to kind of clarify. I think I said, why did Amanda use the wrong bathroom? She didn't use it, she just walked in and realized. I'm saying she came out, her face is so red. So she didn't use it, just happened to walk in. Do it a hard U-turn, 180. Going underneath the arch. Hi, how are you? All right, we're entering to San Francisco. We're gonna walk right here. There's some bathrooms on the right hand side. Let's just take a little, I don't wanna videotape people going in the bathroom, so it's gonna, gonna talk about it. All right, if you can see there's the bathrooms right back there, right there and there. The men's, the men's is on the left. No, let me get that right. The men's is on the right and the women's is on the left. Men's on the right, women's on the left. I think we're seeing a pattern. We're walking across this bridge here, let's do it. I love the feeling of being in Disneyland. It brings me a lot of joy. It's one of the reasons I like to do these videos a lot. It just brought me so much happiness that I hope that if you ever have a chance to come down to here, to Disney or Disneyland or Walt Disney World, that you have that same amount of joy um, that the rest of us feel, because it's so fun. All right. All right, we're gonna go here into Pixar Pier. Cross Pixar Pier. Right over there, some bathrooms over there, so check this out. So, if you are thinking about coming down to Disneyland, make sure you use the right bathroom so you don't have that embarrassing moment like my wife did. But if you want to come down, the best way to get the lowest prices on tickets is to call 1-855-GETAWAY. And when they answer, tell them Provost Park Pass sent you. They'll be sure to get you the lowest prices on your hotel rooms, your tickets. They'll help you plan your whole vacation. It's who I use when I come down here. And, uh, and so, I love using them. They're awesome. They treat us really good. They'll treat you well too. Or you click the link down below. All right, let's continue on looking around. You just had a family, just, they're like, oh my gosh, I, just, I love your videos. They're like, we found you because you're watching your video about how to do Genie Plus. And I was like, oh yeah. I said, uh, I just actually just made a brand new video about Genie Plus uh, for 2024 because there's some new changes. So if you're thinking about coming to Disney, you can watch that video too. It's going to tell you everything you need to know about coming to Disney, how to maximize your time for Genie Plus and how to get the most rides. Because it's expensive. So if you're going to use it, make sure you get the most out of it. All right, let's continue on down here. I love Pixar Pier. There's some people like, oh, they feel like it's kind of generic. Hello. I don't feel that way. Hi guys. Hi. I, I think it's awesome. I just like, I like it. I like the feel of it. I think it's really cool. All right, let's turn here and go into there's some bathrooms right back here. Looks like the credit coaster is closed today. They have jacked num num cookies. All right, we're gonna walk over here. 
Now you'll notice the bathrooms we're gonna walk by and what do we see? Men are on the left, women is on the right. I don't like to film people going in the bathroom so it's gonna kind of walk by real quickly. See the men right there, if you're looking at it, it's right there on the left. There's the women right down there on the right. All right, there's the Pixar Pal Round, also sometimes known as the Wheel of Death. We're gonna continue on down here through Pixar Pier and walk around that way, uh, turn to the right. So here I am down here by the, uh, what is it, inside, what do they call it, inside out? It's not two anymore, it's just inside out. But I'm wondering what's gonna happen because inside out two is gonna be coming out. Are they gonna add new emotions to it? Probably not, it's the inside out emotional whirlwind. And they got all the little motions on it. Fun thing about that attraction though, is when you write it, there's five different voices. One time it's gonna be fear, it'll be joy, sadness, disgust, and, and anger. So you can write it five times in a row and it's always gonna have a different voice talking to you, which I think is really cool. All right, so we're walking back here. This is by the Paradise Garden Grill. I'm gonna walk right past that, you're gonna see there's the men and women's bathroom right there. It says women right there, men right there. The men's on the left-hand side, and the women is on the right-hand side. <laughs> Have you ever done that though, where you walked into the wrong bathroom, just walked in, you're like, oh my gosh. And yeah, it's, I think almost everybody's done that. Put it down below if you've had that embarrassing experience. <laughs> That's just, yeah, it's usually like when you're tired too, right? You're not paying attention, you're just walking, you're like, ah. I know it's exactly why you watch Provost Park Pass to get an in-depth expose on bathroom culture. Now, since we're on the subject of bathrooms, it'd be super easy for me to make some potty jokes. I'm not gonna do it, guys, because I'm gonna be honest with you, but poop jokes are not my favorite. They are a solid number two, though. I don't think this is the time for that type of humor. All right, now let's go down here. Check out the restrooms down here. I will say this, if you ever get super thirsty, never be tempted to drink out of a toilet. There are two excellent reasons why you should never drink out of a bathroom. Number one and, and number two. <laughs> <laughs> get it? All right, we're right over right across the street here from the Grizzly River Rapids and there's actually a bathroom right over there. All right, so right behind me is a restroom and if you're facing it, the men's is on the right and the women's is on the left. Walking back here, one of my very favorite sounds. I love this sound. I'm gonna be quiet just so you guys can hear it. I did a video a while back about like, the top five sounds voted by you, and uh, that was surprising. You guys voted for that sound, and so glad you did because I love it too. It's just, it's for me, it's like relaxing. I, I could listen to that. Like, that'd be nice to listen to like when I'm getting ready to fall asleep at the end of the day, just listen to that sound. Super, I think it's, it's got, it's got rhythm, it's rhythmic. It's got a nice pop to it. I love it. Walking by the waterfalls. Love it. Do you guys know why the toilet paper tumbled down a hill? Oh, you know, to get to the bottom. Right, not the time for jokes. Why didn't the toilet paper cross the road? Well, because it got stuck in a crack. I'm so pleased with myself right now. These are, this is gold, guys. Okay, we're walking over here. This is Soren right over there. And you can see there's some restrooms right onto the right hand side, right back over here. All right, I did notice that one's a little bit different. That one has men on the left and women on the right. Huh. All right, so I'm right here by Humphreys, the um, gift shop. But this, this is something that's really awesome because my wife Amanda loves this place because you come here, you order your Coke, and they have those freestyle Coke machines where you get your Coke flavored the way that you like it. Something kind of cool, unique. Just so, I don't know, I, don't know, I thought I was showing that to you. All right, let's continue on with the bathroom tour. Look at the beautiful balloons. I love it. Do you hear them? All right, let's continue on. All right, guys, let's go back to where we started, where this incident happened. And I know that you guys come to Provost Park Pass for this in-depth, hard-hitting investigative journalism like this. And I'm going to give it to you. It's almost summertime. I love that. Do you guys uh, 
I love going to summer movies, like blockbuster movies, the popcorn flicks. That's always fun for me and Amanda, my wife, to go to it. Have you guys seen that uh, that new movie, Constipation? Oh, you, you haven't because it hasn't come out yet? Let's go back to the scene of the incident. The great fiasco, the bathroom fiasco of 2024. Dun, dun, dun. All right, I'm gonna turn it here and go in here and then turn to the right to go to that restroom. What have we learned? Well, what we've learned every single bathroom here at Disney, the women are on the, uh, was it the left and men are on the right. Don't know why that is. Just maybe, a, maybe it's a, there's a reason for that maybe. I don't know. Women are usually on the, on the left and men are on the right. I think that what happens is that we get conditioned. We just get used to going to the bathrooms. So as a guy, we just get used to going to the bathrooms on the right, and women just get used to going to the bathrooms on the left. And what happened was my wife, I think, was super tired, wasn't paying attention, and check this out. <laughs> so I think she just came over here. She was tired. Had a long day. Walk over here. Hi, how are you? And what do you see here? The restrooms. And what is it? The men is on the left, and the women's is on the right. And I think what happened, she just wasn't paying, she's just so used to going to, what, which way? I'm getting confused now, right? She's just so used to going to the left, but she probably wasn't paying attention. She just bebopped in using that left-hand entrance, pretend like she owns the world, just walked in there, gets in there, realized she's in the wrong thing, turned around, came out. Her face was beet red. She, it was so funny. We, la we still laughed about this day because uh, it wasn't like just barely in. She like walked in there and all of a sudden she's like, oh my gosh, all the way like the sinks and then turned around and she's like, dying of embarrassment. Has that happened to you guys? But I think we now know why it's happened. It's because most of the bathrooms here in Disneyland, women are on the uh, right and men are on the, no, 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 women are on the right. No, no, women are on the left and men are on the right at most of the bathrooms here. And I think they just trained us to do that. But every once in a while they switch it up and it throws us off our groove. The groove, the groove, our emperor's new groove. All right, I gotta find a little tiny spot so I can talk to you guys. Let's do that right now. That's a great little stroller parking spot here. Uh, right next to Monsters Inc. and there's nobody here. So I have a chance to sit down and really focus uh, my energy on you. I want you to know that I am talking to you right now. Um, and you might be thinking, you can't be talking to me. If you're thinking that, get that thought out of your mind. I want you to know how amazing you are. And I want you to know that I appreciate you. I think that you are awesome. I hope you hear that enough in your life. I hope that you get enough positive feedback in your life. And if you don't, I'm sorry because sometimes it's difficult. I feel like the world's a little bit unhinged right now. There's a lot of negativity out there going on. And we don't hear a lot of positive. And it's really easy for people to be negative. I want you to know that you are awesome. You make the world better. And I am talking to you, and I mean it from my heart. I'm proud of you. You're awesome. All right, let's continue on. Oh my gosh, you guys, I just was in the bathroom, and there was a dog in the bathroom with me. Yeah, it was a poo doll. Thank you so much for watching this little fun video for me to do for you guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you made you laugh or at least made you smile. If you hit that like button, if you smiled, then hit that like button. <laughs> if at any point you actually laughed out loud, then hit the subscribe button. Now, I just wanna say this. At the end of this video, we have a screen going with a bunch of names on it. Those are our Patreons. Those are people who uh, support uh, Provost Park Pass. And we're actually gonna be going on a cruise with a bunch of our Patreons. If, if you wanna be part of that amazing community, get some exclusive videos just for Patreon, there's a link down below. Click on that and you can join for as little as $3 a month. It's something that I'm really proud of. I love our paycheck community. Your name will be on that end screen card coming up here right about now. My wife walked in the wrong bathroom all the way to the sink and realized she made a mistake and she hustled on out, but she was so embarrassed. Yeah, she went in the wrong bathroom because she went out the left way and that wasn't the right way because she went the left way, which wasn't the right way. It's not the Disney way.